Winston has returned. We have won. Announce. Trolls, lend me your ears. The old king has returned after being trapped under the heel of the jester, the false king. Ashton the jester is a failure who tried to subvert the kino and tried to replace God Winston. The jester had three knights at his command for Speak City, who after all his months of loyal service was fired by Andy Wolski. He now lurks in the church of Suffer Longing for the days when he was a Ashton Capel. He did it for free. <laughs> the Squire of Gardos and Brian Dunn. These knights managed the dealings of the jester and they got into the ear of the old king, spreading lies to make him weaker. The squire ran God Winston's Twitter account and kept information from him. The speaker city was deemed a tastemaker of sorts. He and the squire were allowed to choose when God Winston appeared and when he didn't. This explains the prolonged absence of God Winston. He was kept hidden in order to protect Ashton. The squire was given the key to guard Winston's cage and Prospico said he chose one to let him out. The jester wanted to become king, so he the real one. But God Winston has returned working all alone as a spy. The insider Ralphamay reveals his hand. He let Ashton and his knights control him so he could gain their secrets to expose them. He went on the Kino Casino to prosecute the Padopi of Flamenco, but also to gain insights on the operations of the Kino Casino. And he was skis done. He thought time was his ally, but time is never an ally. You dug your own grave now, lie in it.